If you had the choice between Infamous 1 and 2 getting a remake treatment or a brand new Infamous game, what would be your choice? Now, you might hate my answer guys, but personally I would prefer a brand new Infamous game. These may eventually, and I mean 5% chance at highest, 5% chance maybe these get ported over to the PS5. I highly doubt it, but a brand new Infamous game would be really, really enjoyable. Maybe one where you can even create your own character, and it goes sort of the same route of Infamous Second Son, where you get multiple powers, or maybe you even get to choose your own powers. That would be kind of cool, but I feel like maybe they'd try and push that into a live service game, maybe? I don't know. It's just the way that a lot of games are going now. All right, Z. Headed in to look for the room they kept Mary. Keep an eye out above ground for the cross, would you? Sure, man. Happy to help. Just wish you'd lean on me more. I got your back, brother. Now, what's weird is there is two story-related missions. They don't actually really add to anything, so we haven't missed anything, but there's two story missions that are locked behind the user-generated content which you need to connect to the servers for. Now, I've connected to the servers. You know, man, I've been thinking kind of badass as a vampire. I mean, being able to turn into a big old flock of bats and things like that, that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, and I can eat a lot of bugs. Like, crazy fast. It's awesome. I'm sure they'll make a comic book out of me. <laughs> sure. They'll call you the bug biter. Yeah. Oh. Man, the vampire sense it's tingling. No way. There's a break in the wall. It's... It's not there. That's the vampires, man. They can glamour people, make them see things that ain't there, even walls. This is some FromSoft game shit. <laughs> hey, so they put in some sort of dumbwaiter with like a propane tank in it. it says white phosphorus on the side. Whatever you do, do not shoot that tank. Okay, all right. I'll just smoke the elevator's in for you. White phosphorus will set fire to anything. Couldn't be more dangerous. Although it is kind of cool. Right, sure that's destroyed now. That's destroyed, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's destroyed, yeah. Okay. I hope it isn't the same situation as the last part where I traversed all the way through the catacombs and it was like, oh yeah, you're actually supposed to use your vision at the start of the mission, and it just didn't tell us. But yes, two of the missions are locked behind user-generated content. The actual story missions as well, so not just missions, you know, that people have created. And I don't know why they've made them, so you have to connect to the server to have them online. Surely they should just be in the game. I don't know, it's just kind of weird, I don't understand it. No. Oh, Shadow Stake here, new power, so hold up, let's give it a go. Hang on, let's wait for one of the enemies to be on the ground, maybe. Hang on. Here we go, let's try it. Oh, wow, okay, that's cool. So we got, like, a new superpower. Yeah, baby! I love it! Get down, sexy lady. Bitch. How many times can we actually use that funky little power? Saying there's an enemy up there. Okay. I don't know if we have to find this glyph, but don't believe we do. Hang on. Yeah, looks like we have to kill all these enemies. Here we go, let's use it again. Ah, oh, damn it, missed what? Come on, no, really? Right, get her. Really? Oh, okay, okay. So it doesn't tell you on the tutorial part of it, but you're actually supposed to press square when you do that lunge, otherwise you just lunge randomly. Don't know why it didn't tell me that. Found another phosphorus tank. So we've got a dead man. Same sort of dumb way with the surface. Kill the engine on that thing, man. You know what? I think them fangers are looking to burn the city down with all that phosphorus. Widespread arson no one could stop. It's payback for burning Bloody Mary way back when. That makes sense. All the vampires be safe underground, while topside, human barbecue. Oh, that Mary. Good. Yeah, you don't have to tell me. She was chewing my neck like gum. White phosphorus just reminds me of that one moment in Spec Ops Align. Oh, what a sad game that is, man. That is a dark game. 
few enemies, we can deal with this. See what I mean? The electric doesn't really do that much. You, you, you're all better off just meleeing all these enemies. Get them down a bit quicker. Bastard. <laughs> Bastard. So all these vampires are British now. Comes to think of it, when you see vampires, a lot of them are British, aren't they? Okay, that's another few gone. Three more. We can do this. Ah, they're all up there. It's so dark, man. Jesus. Oh, come on. Right, sexy lady. Gotcha. Two more, two more. Ah, they can interrupt it. Okay, so if they hit you while you're doing that, it can actually interrupt the attack. Ah, uh, noted. Oh, killing so many sexy women. Painful! Okay, so when there's a big white circle around here, that is showing you like there is a door that like, you need to go to. And, okay, so when these signs show up, normally they show up with... Hang on, let me show you. They show up with Mary's teachings, which are audio logs about what antics she's essentially been up to, you know, what evil stuff. Like, say, the sailors, she was actually... She convinced a load of sailors who mistaken her for a lady of the night. Her words, not mine. And she asked for a soundproof room and a really sturdy door in exchange. So they were like, yeah, yeah, you know, this really sexy woman. All she wants is a sturdy soundproof room with, you know, a door. And... They didn't Broken think. Out, you know, I can't imagine they'd need me more. That white phosphorus is nasty. All talk about white phosphorus just makes me want to replay Spec Ops the line now. I can't remember what game released alongside that, but it, it released alongside a game similar to, you know, like when Mad Max released on the same day as Metal Gear Solid 5, and it just, you know didn't get as much as attention as it would have if it released on its own. It was a similar situation, Spec Ops Alliance released either the same day or the same week as another More one. the same, plus some sort of iron key. Huh, kill the engine first, then maybe that key will fit in the big old iron door near the east end of the tunnel. Hey, that could be Mary's crypt room. See, I thought I said it was too dangerous to come down here. Now come on, man, I had to look around a little. My buddy's life's on the line. Hey, get to the coven door. Yeah, Spec Ops Alliance released in the same week as like another big game. Oh, I can't remember what it is and it's bugging me. It wasn't a GTA game, it was something else. It was a big enough game that had all the attention on it. And I can't remember what it was. Maybe, I don't know, even something like, oh shit. Oh, oh god damn, oh god damn, oh god damn. Right, here we go. Missiles, come on baby. Go. Let's stake all these. God damn. Oh, we actually blew them up. Here we go. Bitch. Right, how many more are there? Three left. Oh, some of them are down. Okay. Right, let's get these ones that are down. Wait, it's showing. Aha! You, you're some motherfucker. Bitch. Oh, that didn't even properly get him then. <laughs> Bitch. Now we've got him. No, now we've got him, okay. Alright, jump up here. Da -da 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 -da. Sexy lady, I'm running right past you. Because I need to get in this door. Oh. Damn it! Boom! One more, one more. Here we go. Oh, I could have actually just downed all the enemies and it would have let me get to the door because it gave me the option then to unlock the door. Even though she wasn't dead, she was only downed. What waits behind? Evil door number one! Nothing good, I can tell you that. Yeah, this is it. This is where I was bitten. Look around. Who knows? They might have stashed across there. 
If this is going to be some from soft type of chest, I'm out. The things inside Mary's trunk told her story. As a governess, man, she was great with kids. Unfortunately, one of them gave her smallpox. She was all but dead when a secret admirer decided that she was too beautiful to slip away. Reborn as a vampire, Mary was always at Marco's side. Two of them drank their way through Europe, never bothering to watch the shadows. But you see, the same priest that had been with Mary at her deathbed, he had never given up on her. And he knew that killing Mary's maker would turn her back into a human. But he didn't know that that trick only worked on a vampire's first night. With Marco dead, she flew into a rage. And it was then Father Ignatius learned just how terrifying those monsters could be. Poor fella ran for it. Spent the next 37 years just one step ahead of Mary. But on the edge of the new world, in New Marais, she finally caught up to him. With nowhere left to run, Ignatius moved quick. Gathered the townsfolk together and struck first. Well, you know the rest. No Barb Cross. Just a bunch of Mary's crap. Oh, I got you covered on that cross. You just spotted a big old bloodsucker with it. The guy's just circling around. You watch yourself, Cole. This smells like a trap. I don't have much of a choice. I need that thing. Okay, we have got two more missions left, guys. Really short DLC, but considering the price of it, it's... I'd say it's fairly priced. Although it is like an hour worth of gameplay for ten pound, but to be fair, I've spent more game, more on games with uh, less hours. Say the order eighteen eighty six. As much as people want to dunk on that game, I thought it was an absolutely brilliant game. Okay, uh, I don't know if we go this way. Looks like maybe. Oh, oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! I haven't got electric. I haven't got electric. I haven't got electric. I haven't got electric. Shit. Okay. I think that's where we have to go. Where is he? Where is he? You big bitch. Right? Missiles. Shit. Oh, okay. You can actually use that funky attack on him. Here we go, bitch. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, you want some fool? Let's go fool. Oh. 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 And you're down for the kill, motherfucker. Maybe I was getting a bit too excited there. Oh, don't tell me there's a vampire in... Oh, for fuck's sake. Take him. No, no, no. Don't take me. No. See ya. I want no parts of this. <laughs> no. Nope. I'm just gonna go. I want no parts of it. Oh, please say I can get out of here. Please say I can get out of here. Please say I can get out of here. Yes! Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> now we've got two more missions, so we're gonna try and squeeze another mission in. I'm not gonna end the part at like 14 minutes. Right, here we go. Uh, anyone to eat? It doesn't look like there's anyone anywhere. Let's get some electric, actually. This is where you actually... Uh, you have a fight with a bunch of soldiers here. And it's where you can choose what powers to eventually get. So you can choose Nyx's Napalm Power. Or Quo's... Uh, Ice power. Now the funny thing is, when you when you side with Quo and get her ice power, you think, oh yeah, you know, she's a good option for the game. She actually ends up being the bad option for the game, which is weird because throughout the whole game, she's the reasonable one. She's giving you advice, you know, Nyx is doing all the evil stuff, killing all the people, going on rampages and everything like that. So you think, obviously, oh, Nyx is bad, but it does like an old switcheroo where Nyx ends up being the good one. So, that was kind of a weird change-up, to be honest. Da -da 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 -da, I'm just flying through the air. Uh, you know what? I'd, lo I'd love to see more games that are under 10 hours long. Obviously, adjust the price, obviously. Say, similar to like a Miles Morales experience, because game development, I know obviously, because there's a hell load more detail in games, you know, people want a lot more from them, but... 
how long it takes games to make now. I mean, we're already four, nearly five years into this generation, I think. Uh, I think I've counted that right. And some studios, we still haven't seen any games from them. I mean, and it's already been about five years, you know, we don't know what they're working on, anything like that. And obviously, I know game development, a lot of the time, the development cycles now are about anywhere between five and seven years, but I much prefer the smaller games. Just give us the smaller games, that way we can get games more regularly. The cave pooper with the cross is just going in circles. I swear, man, this is a setup. Yeah, I gotta go for it, Steve. If I don't whack Mary in the next few hours, I'm gonna be able to up with She threatened to dress me up in a sailor outfit, Z. Then let's see you fly, night flapper. Fly after the vampire guardians, they have the Bob Cross. There we go. Big trap coming up. Ah, it's just a chase mission, okay. Okay, so we're just gonna have to chase them. Here we go. Oh, my man. I hate chase sequences. Oh, come on. Here we go. Finally got it. Now, where is it actually going to lead us to? I'm just glad it is making us fight a load of enemies along the way. You know, we are just trying to get there. Come on, where have you gone now? Down there. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Right, let's use uh, missiles to get rid of these enemies. Here we go. Why would you want to hurt me with that cross, Cole? All I've done is give to you. Share the gift of immortality. You should be kissing the hem of my dress. Because you're a bitch. Da, 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 da. Oh, that was lucky. That was lucky. So fly for the first one or you lose your trial. That's what I'm trying to do. Power lines it is. And there's no power. Oh, no, there is. Okay. Ah, over there. Okay, okay, okay. Right, give me some blood. Give me some blood. Give, give me some blood. This is probably one of the harder tailor missions, if I'm honest, because you can only really chase it when you're using the blood. Okay, where have you gone to now? Bitch. You're playing with fire, Newborn. You may have gifts beyond the average vampire, but my patience with your antics is very thick. Okay, so it seems like every time the firstborn stops, we need to get a hit out on it, and then it progresses to another area, so it's, it's going to take a while, this one. Come on, bitch. Stop doing this. Blood. Thank you. If we could seamlessly fly between the locations, it would be a lot easier, but it's a fact you have to stop each time in order to get some blood. How far away is it now? Oh god, we might lose it. Oh Jesus, that is... I think it... Yeah, that's far away, man. Oh god damn it. Oh Jesus. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do, fly after the first spawn. Right. Someone give me some blood. Okay. I'm trying to do Zeke, you little poo head. Oh, you good cause you need to be locked down. Yeah, don't worry, you won't die. Your limbs will be sewn back together with time. And by then, I'll make sure you're as docile as a lamb. Hey, come on. Stop with your headache. Come on. Just, just take some ibuprofen. Oh, sneaky devil. Okay. Is this where you fight this motherfucker? Right. Missiles. Jesus. Jesus. Some electric. Oh. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Bitch. Give us it, give us it. Oh. Uh, 
Okay, I want to pick up the barbed cross, but I'm nearly dying. Okay, here we go, here we go. Get it, get it. Yes! Oh, toe shoes! Damn. This thing's... Damn! Just getting near that cross made Cole's undead skin crawl and itch. It was powerful, all right. Just the thing to end Mary and her kin. Oh, we got one more mission left, guys. Already the end of the game. That's weird. Already the end of the game. <laughs> all right, Mary. Let's find out who's in control now. Hey, man, while you're keeping Mary busy, I'll head underground for that white phosphorus. What, you don't think I can take her? Well, on the off chance you're still a blood connoisseur come sunrise, I'd rather not have to die in a fire. Besides, I can't just sit around and do nothing. Don't you worry about me, Zeke. With this cross, I'm made in the shade. Made in the shade. Okay, how far away is this? Uh... It's not too far away. You know what? I'll end that part here because there's no point in you guys just watch me traverse for, uh, what, two, three minutes? It's just pointless. And I need the toilet as well, to be honest, guys. I know that's personal, but, you know, gotta be real with you, gotta make that connection. I need the toilet.